Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and hello everyone. My name is Abdul Karim Alias from University of Science Malaysia. In this video, I would like to show how to embed or how to add discuss discuss D I S Q U S or discuss. So what is discuss? So let me show let me show you. So this uh, website uh, I'm using Google site. To, for, for this uh, training module or teaching module. And if you want to have your students to give feedback or to have kind of a forum, you can embed something like this. So as you can see here. So this is what is discussed. This is the, the application called Discuss, which is free. You can embed it so that you can have kind of a forum or a place where your students or your participants can give feedback, can ask questions, they can have a conversation here with other students or with other participants. And you can have a thread, we call it a, a thread uh, discussion, which is very, very useful to get an interactive uh, you know, interaction between the students and also for the students or participants to ask questions. So you can embed or add or integrate this this one using application called Discuss. So this is what I'm going to show you in this video because there are not many uh, good tutorial because um, it's a bit tricky, just a little bit tricky to integrate Discuss in the website. So I've just said that one in my website here. So this is a new one uh, I've just added. So there's no discussion yet. There's no postings from the students. So this is how it looks like. Okay. So to, to add this one, um, go to the website discuss.com and I'm going to add this to my another website here. So if I scroll down, I want to add at the end of this page. Currently, I don't have Discuss integrated. So this is what I'm going to show you step by step. So sign up for Discuss. In my case, I will log in. I have already signed up. So you can sign up with Facebook, Twitter, or your Gmail. In. Okay, then we go to the admin page. Okay, and here your sites, I already have 17. So just click and click new. And that's the list of whatever that website that you have integrated discuss in. Okay, and on the website name, you just give what is uh, suitable name in this case I do want um, I would say micro credential so that would just remind me this is a discussion forum for my micro credential page and select the category the category there are not many categories here so maybe you won't find something that is relevant but I think this doesn't really matter so I just put tag here. There's not even one on education. So I find the category here is a bit limited. So choose whatever. I think this, this, this is not really uh, very critical. Then click create site. And you will see, you will get this, uh, this page where you can select a plan for plus pro and business. So you just choose anyone. Uh, it doesn't really matter. Start trial 30 days here. Choose this one, then click subscribe now, and then you get to this page. So this is the important one. So you get to this page. Scroll down until you don't see uh, until you see this one. I don't see my platform listed. Install manually with universal code. So click that, and you get a tutorial. But this is actually a general tutorial. So what I'm going to show you a specific method or procedure how you want to embed Discuss into your Google site. 
So you scroll down and these are the codes. So a little bit of playing with the uh, coding here, not much, only two or three steps, that's all. So this is what the tutorial is about, to show you how to do it correctly, okay? And you just click copy here on the top uh, right here, click copy, so you have copied the whole code here, okay? Now go back to the website or to the Google site where you want to embed, discuss, and in this case, I want to pull on the home page or the front page. And then uh, this is on the view mode. So I want to go to my edit mode. So you can sign up into your Google site account and go into the edit mode. If you are familiar with Google site, it is the back end or the edit mode for Google site. So you just scroll down where you want to insert. In this case, I want to insert here so you can go uh, insert and click embed or you just double click here and click embed and then by url or by embed code in this case this embed code then just click paste and click next oh sorry before that before that, uh, I want to make sure that uh, I get the URL for this publish page. We have to publish your Google site first before you get the URL or the address for this particular page because you need this information when you do the when you make some changes in the coding. Okay, so I forgot about that step. So I will copy copy link. So make sure you have published this uh, before that before this you have published the page so that you can get this link. Otherwise, um, this icon will be dim. Okay. So I will just quickly uh, paste here. Um, I, uh, I have to go back to just now, copy again, copy this code again. Okay. And go back again to this page, to the website where I want to insert my Discuss, uh, integrate my discuss. So double click, click embed, embed code, and paste. So before you click next, you have to do something with the coding here. So this is a very important step that you have to note down. So if you scroll down, this is uh, how long is the code? Not much. You have to change actually only two things. One is the page URL, which is the URL of the published page, which just now I have copied, and then the page identifier. These are only the two things that you need to change. But before that, you have to delete a few lines starting from here, the double, the, the slash double star there, and scroll down a little bit until this part. Okay before just before the well the variable discuss config okay that part this part okay this is very crit critical so delete that part just delete and then you have to delete another one which is this one delete that and that's all now you need to change the page url select or highlight that and then you have to put the page URL just now, which is the, this page, this particular this particular page, which I have copied the address just now. So I now copy again the address. And then you want to put it here. But before that, you have to put the URL within the, you have to put the, the uh, what is it, apostrophe, apostrophe here, and then paste the URL and then at the end here another close another apostrophe you know so at the beginning here and at the end this is important if you miss this step then it will not work <laughs> all right so done one part another part is a page identifier again you have to put uh, apostrophe apostrophe what do you call this apostrophe here yeah? and paste and another apostrophe 
but you have to delete the front part here https until this dot google dot com delete that part then you are done basically you are done that's the steps then you click next yes now discuss has appeared if you get to this stage you are you are okay then click insert there you are you already have your discuss and all you need to do is just list, adjust the, the width of the pitch so now you are done republish republish the page to update okay this is how you do it in google site uh, in, in different different uh, web uh, web uh, builder maybe it works slightly different but i think basically that's the basic which you can use also to integrate discuss in other websites so now i'm going to publish and publish and now i can view the publish page and scroll down and see whether you can find our discuss yes it works <laughs> it works that's basically how you want how you can integrate or add discuss uh, which basically a place where the participant or the students can have a discussion and interaction okay so with that i think that's all thank you very much and i hope this video will be very useful to help you to integrate discuss into your google site or maybe to your other website as well see you in another video thank you